Hello again, this is Trans Air, and coming to you again with another video review. And today we're taking a look at the new Mini Warrior to all our fun Bushwhacker. And there he is in his Outback Cruiser mode. And first and foremost, I want to thank my good buddy Jason Watson for helping me get this figure. Thank you, dude. You rock. So, yeah, look up Jason on Facebook. Jason Watson on Facebook, message him, tell him I sent you, and he will hook you up with Mini Warriors for a great price. So, so again, check Jason Watson out on Facebook, and tell him I sent you. So, he has a lot of these figures up for grabs, once again. So, that's all I could say, so thanks again, Jason. You rock. Back to the figure. And first and foremost... We got him in his vehicle mode here, and let's take a quick look at the packaging. Got a nice picture of Bushwhacker there, aka Outback. The G1 Outback. You got To All Our Fun, Bushwhacker, MW08, Mini Warriors, To All Our Fun. You come around on the side, you got Mini Warriors, Bushwhacker again. You got the same thing on this side. From Land Cruiser and back again. Many words, Land Cruiser and back again. So cool, yeah. You come to the bottom of the box. You got Diller 3D Concept Toy Design. Warning, 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 warning. Recommend for ages 18 and up. Get it? 18 and up. This is a collector's. <laughs> so, tricky parts. Yeah. But anyway, back to Bushwhacker. So, you come around to the back here got a nice tech spec well it's like a tech spec it's just like shows shows a grid of his robot mode and his vehicle mode he got it got a nice bio of him here if I can zoom in for you come on there you go pause it if you want to read it so yeah it's a box so yeah also comes with this collector card it says bushwhacker on it it's like a credit card thickness and you got the tech specs here and you got that grid just like on the back back of the box the grid looking for robot and vehicle very nice so yeah it's a credit card thickness card so yeah set that off to the side and here you got bushwhacker in his Vehicle mode. And you guys are saying that does look like the G1 version of Outback. It it does. All, all I'm thinking it is, it's just an oversized version of these mini warriors. To make them a ma little masterpiece. That's what I'm thinking. But again, what could you do? So yeah, he comes with a nice little weapon. You can take it off. Nice little weapon. Set that off to the side. And you got him in his vehicle mode. You got that nice design of the G1 version. Very nice. Very cool detailed. So yeah. I would like to get uh, get a hold of the hench figure. The green version of him. His name would be, be Brawn for the G1. But hench is the original name for the Mini Warriors. So yeah. Very cool indeed. So, enough of that. Let me do a comparison with his uh, other mini warrior. Other mini warrior is Dune Raker, aka Beachcomber. So you can say they scale pretty good for the mini warriors. As long as they're not going like big to small, then they're small to big. So it's not like they're gonna screw screw up anything it's very cool I really like it how they scale these up they're about the same size I really love it so enough of that set him off to the side and let's transform out back and see how cool he actually is first thing I do is come here to the front untab these come to the back push this piece down and you want to untab these just a little bit you want to pull this panel up, this panel up too, 
These are on a ball joint, so it moves in and out, but you want to make sure they're like that. You want to move his leg out. Visible head syndrome. You want to rotate it down. This is what's tricky about this. You want to try to bring it out this way. Collapse this in. You have to make sure that ball joint's right there. And you tab it in. So yeah, his feet's backwards right now. So do the same thing on this side. Very tricky to do this. Come on. Got his... Come on. Tab it in. And there you got him. His legs done. And you want to move these panels up enough. You will pull this piece back, and this you can reach in here and grab his arm. Grab his arms there. Then you want to shut that back, like so. But actually, don't want to shut that back. I'm being a dummy right now. You want to rotate these around for his legs. Like so, come on, there we go. And there you got him in his robot mode. Very cool indeed. There you got Bushwhacker, aka Outback, in his robot mode. He's kind of top heavy in a way. So, yeah, kind of top heavy pretty cool pretty cool indeed so yeah he can hold his weapon very tight to get in there so yeah there you got bushwhacker and his well he fallen over Man, I'm really digging that look for Bushwhacker, man. That really sets it off, man. I really like his figure. But yeah, very cool. I would like to try to get the hench version of this guy. But again, what could you do? So yeah. But enough of that. Why don't I take a good size comparison with his, with the other mini warrior named Dune Raker. And there he is. And they really scale up together. Very cool indeed. I really like that. So yeah, very awesome indeed. Very good scale. With the other mini warriors. I'm not complaining. Set him off to the side. Let's get down to the detail on him. He got a nice red. Not red. Blue. Visor for his eyes. Very awesome. But the cool fu funny thing is about this. He has two heads. Yeah this one. The cartoon Acker head. Then you want to reach around here. Fiddling. And trying to get the other head out. The other one doesn't have a. Has a different blue visor. Come on. They don't really give you. This is the one thing that really irritates me. They don't give you enough room to reach in here. To swivel with his heads around. There we go. There. You can see that's a different head. Very cool. Now let's get back to the G1 looking head. Come on. So I mean it's like really tough to grab his head to move it around. There we go. Got it. So yeah. I really dig the silver paint on his arms. 
and I love it how the wheels fold up together making one leg and it really makes a nice knee joint very cool so yeah you got articulation for them and you can go all the way around go in and out bend at the elbow same way on this side you can bend at the knee swivel out and back so yeah even got these little pieces here to stabilize them so if you want to do that push them down and there you go you're good to go so yeah you can do anything with these wings here for on the back I prefer them to get them out of the way hide them <laughs> so yeah very cool indeed all he needs is an Autobot symbol which will I will add when I get a chance so so this is the new mini warrior the new Mini Warriors Bushwhacker, a.k.a. Outback. And this is Trans Aaron talking to you again. Don't forget to rate and subscribe and comment on any videos that I do. And keep a lookout for any new videos heading your way. And this is Trans Aaron talking to you again. Have an awesome day.